Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tasman Rain, and today we came up with this look. It's super cute. Um, I'm just going to the grocery store and I feel like being cute. So, this is really pretty palette by Jaclyn Hill. Super nice, super cute. I am doing a giveaway. I got the eight brushes. Can I get some light? I got another Jaclyn Hill palette. And I got a sponge. And all you have to do is subscribe, like, and go to my comments on Instagram. And I'm going to leave my name. Try to leave it right here. In one of these spots. And all you have to do is put an orange heart for the fall on my new picture. That I'm going to post on Instagram today. Or whenever I upload this picture. Um, and that's all you have to do. And I am super excited because... This is my first giveaway. I've never done a giveaway. I don't know why, but I deleted all my videos from my... I used to I used to post, like, makeup tutorials, and I deleted them all. Um, I don't know what happened, but I did. And now I'm just going to come back and make videos again, because I miss YouTube. I got a new setup, a new camera, a new ring light so yes i will start making videos again make sure you stay tuned thank you here we are here we are so today mm, jacqueline hill palette i am going to do my makeup do my makeup y'all are these like colors in or something because i'm like obsessed i love the color mm, i love it I got these um, skim leggings on. I can't show you because I have a camel toe. <laughs> like the camel toe is real in these, but they're very comfortable. They're very, I can wear them. They're like the sculpting leggings. It's just, they're so freaking long. Like there's no reason I'm like five foot five, I want to say. And I want to say I'm five foot six, but when a doctor does it, they say it's five foot five, but I am tall. I don't care what nobody says. Well, these leggings are very long, and I even washed them and dried them, and they're still long. I bought an extra large in them, and, um, yeah, they're, they're very long. <laughs> Alright, so let's get into it. I am obsessed ever since I discovered this water jelly primer, super fire. I don't know. It just, it does it for me. It works. I know I quit doing YouTube for a very long time. I deleted all my videos. Why? I don't know. And I got some pretty good views. And I deleted all the videos that I had. I don't know if I was like feeling 20, 21. I got very insecure. I gained weight. And um, I haven't really had my psoriasis come out as bad. But I think it's due to being stressed. Like, my psoriasis in my hair was so bad. And I just couldn't film. I was just like, ew. Like, I didn't like what I looked like on the video. I was just starting to get really insecure. Right now, I'm kind of balancing some weight. But, I mean, I'm learning to love myself again. Because I was at a place where I just didn't like the way I looked at all. Like, I was gaining weight. Um, My acne. I haven't had acne this bad in since I was a teenager and then now and I don't know if it's just hormonal because it's like right here but it's getting it's up and down and I'm taking this medicine for it and I don't know if it's working really to be honest yeah it might be time to see a dermatologist because it's not my makeup I clean my brushes all the time I I'm really really good at cleaning I wash my pillows everything so Whatever's going on, it needs to stop. My favorite, favorite, favorite foundation. I mean, this is all I use. I go to the grocery store, I use it other than my Fenty, but my Fenty is a little too light for me right now. This is probably actually going to be a little dark because I bought this back in the summer because I found my bottle that I used to use and it was expired. And I was like, oh my God. I miss using this. Like, I really, really missed using it. How it made my face look. My face looks so beautiful. And I was like, 
I miss you, girl. This is it. This is my favorite. It just works. It does it. Mostly everything in this video is going to be like, oh, my favorite, my favorite. This is not my favorite. I'm going to be honest. I like the regular fix plus like that's like my jam but this was all my Ulta had everybody must have been shopping for makeup that day or something and I haven't been back so I don't know why am I not at work my big baby downstairs Bigfoot is home because he doesn't feel well he called me from school because he has a very bad migraine and he just said his head hurts. And I think it's because they were playing a video game a little longer than what they're supposed to. And they were sneaking the game. I am so excited for fall. I have, I have fall clothes ready to go. But I live in Indiana and everything, like, you go outside right now, it's hot and humid. Like, it doesn't make no sense how humid it is right now. Finally got a new sponge. I don't know if you guys ever watched any of my old videos, but Augie would bite my sponges or he would throw them th through my ring lights and they were ugly. <laughs> so I got a new, I bought a new sponge finally because, ooh, it was just, I got new sponges, but nothing is like a brand new sponge like this. These Morphe sponges are like it. I always want to say beauty blender. It's not a beauty blender, but this is it. It's so fire. Kind of just push it all in. Blend it, mix it. Okay. Now for my concealer, I start off with, where is my medium two? Medium two. I start off with ginger. I don't even know. I'm pretty sure this is not going to match me as well, but I'm, everything else is either too light or too dark. I have nothing that matches my skin like on point. The most exciting thing about fall is watching scary movies or just watching movies, playing in the leaves. Going on the walks, I love waking up and like that fresh, cold, crisp air. Right? Crisp air? Yeah, it's like, oh, it's like everything. I am a winter baby because I'm born in January. But I have always been obsessed with fall. Not just because like Halloween and things, but more like the comfort food and everything we got to eat. Oh, I just can't wait. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. We had chili a couple days ago when it was like a little cooler. And makes me happy. We bake a lot of cookies and stuff. Me and the boys. We have cupcakes downstairs. This is why I can't lose weight. But I we got cookies downstairs that we got to bake. We got cupcakes oreo cupcakes like oh my gosh mm, like just so much going on we just gotta start getting to it for halloween weekend we are going out of town crossing our fingers i bought tickets hopefully it doesn't rain in ohio but i bought tickets for cedar point and like we are super super excited about that I can't believe I got a pimple right there. That is some weird stuff. I never had a pimple by my eyebrow. I mean, by, like, my eye. I think we're going to have a break from all video games and uh, movies tonight just because of how he's feeling. Oh, my God, look. I, I just couldn't film because of this. Like, it, it's embarrassing and but there's it's something I can't control so like why do I sit here and dwell on it like oh I my uh, my hair my hair like there's nothing I could do about it it's just gonna be like this okay so I have to like stop like beating myself down about this and like just do what I want to do I always wanted to film on YouTube I always like 
It was so bad that I missed appointments to go to school for beauty school because I'm like, oh my God, they're going to look at me like, why does she want to go to beauty school with that on her? Like, So it was making me feel really bad about myself and I'm like, I need to not ever just, I was never like this. So, I mean, I think I've been bigger than this and I was like, bitch, I'm fine as fuck. And now I'm just like, oh, I don't want nobody to see my stomach. And I'm like, girl, I was bigger than this and I would wear two pieces on the beach and never, ever, ever care who's seen me. And this year I was like, no, I don't want them to see my bathing suit. Get out of here. I'm going to let, I am going to be healthier and I'm going to be more, it's just, I just need to be better to myself, you know, just gotta be better. So since my eyes are a little, they look glossy, but they're really, really dry. <laughs> a rare beauty. Okay, I do one at a time because I don't like the way it sets. Unless it's just my eye, but it was like not working with me yesterday. My makeup was so pretty yesterday and I have, if for people that are new, I have, I have four boys, four. My youngest is three, my oldest is 10, and my twins are nine. And yes, it's a lot of work. I used to work for the school when my son went to public schools. My son is no longer in public schools my boys are no longer in public schools all of them so I don't work with them anymore even though I hate my new job and I hate it <laughs> there's no reason to hate a job <laughs> like to work at a place that you hate but like the time frame of my job is like it just works so good for my schedule and I actually quit working for this school because my job the school that I was working for closed down because of COVID. And then on top of that, they changed the hours. They displaced me and they tried to get me into a new job, but they didn't give me like, I'm a single mom. So my kids have to be at school at 720 every day, 720. The Augie's daycare, my youngest Augie doesn't open till 730. They wanted me to be at work before 7.30, around 7.20 every day. I'm like, where? How? On top of that, they close our school down and put all the kids into one building. And I'm like, ain't no way. Like, how are these babies supposed to learn when they got so much distractions? Because there's too many kids into one classroom. When... I don't want to get into South Bend Community School. I mean, I don't want to get in. I don't want to get into the school situation and how mad I have been about them since I, like, you know, I got older and I'm like, really? I started working for the schools because I was scared. Like, my oldest son was diagnosed with autism. I'm like, I don't know how these people are, because. I remember one time I took my kid to school and I just seen some random girl that I, I know and she was like a drug addict and she was a teacher and I was like, so y'all just let anybody just work in the schools and I was just like, oh hell no. So I started working for the school because I wanted to know who was my kid's teacher. Like, I was not playing about this. Um... I ended up getting a really, really good, good, like, a decent, a nice job at a really, really good school at that time. And they offered me to send Danny, my Otis, to the school. And I was like, okay, I'm down. Um, and every teacher he has had all, like, through those, that school was awesome. Through the next school that I worked at, awesome. There was a school when I had August um, that he went to. I um, wasn't a fan of any of their teachers. With, I mean, Danny's teacher was good, but she, I don't know if she understood that 
everything. I don't know. I just didn't know her. and But I wasn't a fan for the boys, the twins. I was, like, not a fan. Um, So I sent the boys to a private school. But Danny could not get in because of... He had an IEP. And it just didn't work out at that time. And so now... They're all at a school, and they love it. They absolutely love it. Everything is great, but I miss working with kids. I know I said that I am done. I gotta, I gotta do something else, but I miss it. I really do, but I can't go back. It's not that I can't. It's just I won't. I feel like teachers are underpaid, educators are underpaid teacher assistants are underpaid and I'm like no mm -mm. you have to go through a lot when you work for that type of um environment and I was just like no I need to finally go to beauty college I always wanted to go to beauty college never went because I just had a lot on my plate at a young age, like at 18, I had my first kid. 19, I was, I had three kids. And then now, all the way here. I am just excited because I need to do what I love. My kids are, like, they're getting older. My, like, they're finding themselves. They're, like, really awesome kids. They, they really work hard in school and they like to study and like they're doing so good so now I need to like get on my path and I need to like figure out what I want to do I've always loved beauty I've always loved like makeup I love nails I love hair I love fashion really I really really love fashion I'm a sucker for fashion but little steps little steps all right so the star of the show is this beautiful palette Super beautiful. Such a lovely, lovely palette. I love the colors. And I am like a fan of Jaclyn Hill. I think she's awesome. I have not bought anything from her collection because one time I tried to. Like her new, her new website and her new makeup line. I have not purchased anything because one time I tried to. And every the, the whole collection that I wanted was like sold out so I'm like I don't want it unless I get the whole collection I don't know why I am gonna start out with just barely Ooh. I love that it has a mirror in here but yeah I really really wanted to try I think it was her birthday collection and I went on and it was like sold out so I was like okay never mind or and then I haven't been back on I haven't really purchased much so I got just barely on my crease, like my high crease. Oh, and I purchased the brushes again. It's crazy because when she drops stuff through Morphe, I buy everything. I think I had, I remember I had these like not in this case, but I bought like brushes like individually. And remember because I was working at the mall at the time. And somebody stole all my makeup. They stole all my MAC brushes. They stole all my Morphe brushes. They stole anything you can... My foundation. My... Con they, I think they left one brush. And I think I cried. I was like, I can't believe somebody did this. But, like, I can't believe I didn't lock my doors. That's what really bothered me. Like, how did I forget to lock my doors? And I, like, literally cried. Because I was like, that's so money like I put a lot of money into my makeup like why would somebody do this to me but yeah they got a good little lick when they robbed me mm. I'm gonna go in with this fluffy brush it is the JH 32 right 32 and I'm gonna go in with good vibes because we need all the good vibes and I'm just going to kind of like pack that into the the crease and just work it in keep it not too high, but not too low. Just right there. And then I'm going to go back in with just barely and kind of like blend in. 
anything that doesn't look like just kind of like make sure there's nothing harsh on the eyelids it's one right here right here oh sorry and I'm going to use the color Boo Bear, which I think is fire. Whoa. And I'm just going to keep it really low. Really, really low. And just work it in. Man, I really feel like I can do a fire matte, but I want to use the shimmers. These shimmers are so, so pretty. I don't really feel like this is the same formula as the as her other palettes. I never tried the vault palettes. Never. I never bought them. Um, nothing against it. It's just the time I didn't have the money. So I never got the vault palettes. So I'm just kind of like deepening the crease. Add in some depth in my eyeballs. This Boo Bear color is like it. Yesterday we had pizza. Oh my god, that pizza was so big and I kind of wish we still had some. It was fire. Like our Papa John's normally doesn't get it right. The one where I live on this side of town. But yesterday they did it. They got it right. Okay, I'm still kind of deepening back into this one. And I'm going to go back in with good vibes just a little bit and just kind of like get it back. Get those good vibes back. I am really hoping that I get accepted for school. I feel like I put it off for too long and... You know, when you come out of a really bad relationship, like, you're supposed to bounce back. You are. Like, I know you don't always bounce back, but me, I feel like I need to, I need this bounce back. Like, I need to get my shit together. I finally got my credit a little up. You know, once you stop dealing with bad people, your credit goes up. So, like, that's a good thing for me right now. I love that for me. I have been actually, you know, getting dressed more and doing a lot more for myself. I mean, like, I put a face mask on the other day. I was like, ooh, girl, like, you coming back. And I'm hoping that I do. Like, I'm hoping that I feel normal again to, like, live my life again. Because that was like a life that I know that I should not be putting me and my kids through. And it was like rough. Like really, really rough to like accept that. Like that's not my life. <laughs> okay. I know this video is a little too much. Like it's pretty much everywhere. But it's okay. It's alright. It's alright. So now I'm going to go in with this brush that I told you that didn't come with the collection. Um, it is the JH37 and I'm going to go in with Boo Bear and I'm just going to tap it right here. Just work it. I still, I really, really like this color. This color is so pretty to me. I guess some just like that. Okay, I'm just going to blend it in. Okay, so now I'm going to go in with She Cappins. Super, super, it's like a pinky nude and just bring it in. It'll probably look white on my skin. And just keep like packing it in, packing it in to blend it in. Ooh. 
Ooh, my stomach growled. <laughs> I am hungry. Thinking of that pizza from yesterday. Sheesh, that was so fire. Okay, and then I'm going to go back with this brush and kind of like blend in anything that doesn't look blended. I need to go to the grocery store. I can't wait. I want to go to Trader Joe's today. So I'm going to see if my sister can come over and chill with Danny so I can go to Trader Joe's. I want to make these French toast pumpkin things i seen on TikTok so bad. I'm like, oh, I want to make those. Like, go in. Did I use book? I don't know what I used. I felt like I was using book. That's so funny. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think I'm just picking a color. These browns are like so pretty though. And I feel like these shimmers all go with it. Like you can use one color and then put a shimmer with it and it'd be fire. Okay, so now I am just gonna go in with my finger because I mean you could spritz your brush and like this brush isn't so bad with the um, with the the shimmers but you can do whatever I just want to use the color uh, let's use the color exposed it's like a dark metal gold I'm just gonna like bring it in and pat it over the over the she happens I have this I have a she happens with my Kiera Sky nail polish and it's one of my favorite colors that I got from them. Okay, girl. I want to go apple picking so bad with the boys. I think it'd be so fun. We love apples. Apples are like our favorite thing. And right now, you know, Honeycrisp apples are out and they're in season and that's like our jam. Like, those are my favorite apples, how juicy they are. Okay, I'm just going to keep rubbing this in. Why is it not doing what I wanted it? I really don't feel like this is the same um same formula because I remember the other ones feeling like butter or something like they just didn't feel like this hmm it's okay because I made it work okay I'm gonna go back in with boo bear I'm just gonna kind of like tap this Shit, that scared me I'm gonna go in with the color I'm going to go in with birthday suit and then I'm gonna spritz. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see. And I kinda want it to go a little, like right here. Just to give it a little more pop to it. I was afraid of that, but it'll come out chunky if I did that. Hold on. Whenever your face starts to feel like it's caking, just spritz. And then where's your brush? Use your brush to like push it in. It's alright. It happens. I forgot to set first. I needed to set and I didn't. Let me spray my brush. And I'll just go like this. And I could still use cream over it. I don't know if you guys can do that, but my face doesn't get bad when I do that. I tried it on another person too and it didn't. Nothing bad happened. It just is just to set everything in. 
here I have a scar so it looks kind of weird like when I smile but it's okay I have a lot of scars in my face but it's all right go back in with this brush and I'm just gonna like you know just clean it up I have eyelashes you can't tell right now but I do I promise they're just flat as that this will look so pretty with the wing all right I'm sorry um Somebody gave me a call. I had a phone call. It was really important. But I just finished getting ready. I just did a wing and put on some flossy. This is magical. This is like, whoo, you better be careful because it will draw on your eyeballs. This is the Sephora Colorful Shadow Stick. Oh my God. This is like, better be careful. This boy is dangerous. I need to fix this, so I will, but... Because I messed up on this wing a couple of times. And it was driving me nuts. Because I couldn't focus and talk on the phone. I don't know. So this is like weird. I don't really like filming this part. I was messing up on my wing. And I took a lot of makeup off. So lip combo. First I put my box on. I don't really outline my lips. Like it's just it looks crazy on me. I don't have really big lips. Ooh, it's so beautiful. It's Fenty, which is one of my favorite brands, so I had to. Anything little and cute, I'll get it. I don't care. I love it. Because I normally don't use it all. But I feel like I'm going to use this one all because it's so, so pretty. It's creamy. It's... Ooh, I love it. Here. And I'm going to hit this color and the, these two colors. I'm just going to use these two. And I'm just going to go like this. Because my lips are pink. Oh, it's so pretty. Ooh, I just highlighted my freaking pimple. It's okay. This video was a little bit everywhere, but I'm still going to post it. It's going to be all right. It's it's a good video. I like my makeup right now. Let me spritz it up. 